welcome to Jaws Detected Adventures. Well, in this case, we've got my barrel machine going, we've got all my coins and artifacts in there, been there about 12 hours, and we're gonna see how clean they are. Follow me. Let's up the clean. Let's check it out and see what they're like in there. Come on. Here we go. Open up and away we go. Ugh. Nice and frothy. Make a good cappuccino. That's dirty. Right, let's get the gunge out. That's half crown of Elizabeth II. Nice. <laughs> What's that called? Then? Elizabeth II. Two pound. <laughs> oh, sorry, it's a two pounder. <laughs> yeah. Well, oh. got a bit silver that. Uh, I think that's part of a silver purse. Livery button. Oh, ten pence. Who's to spend them? A bit smaller now. <laughs> this is with the second. See, uh, horse decoration stud. <laughs> the old pound coin. It's looking cash them in at the bank for a pound. <laughs> Military button. That's unusual, look at that. French. Five fr 50 francs, I think it is. 50 francs. It's going up nice, but it ain't gold. Florin of Elizabeth II. Probably 1960s. That's unusual. I think it's some sort of fancy belt buckle. 18th century. That's a, a mount to a draw handle, probably 18th century. Or it could be a um, small little door mount. So I think that's where the, the bar goes through 
for the handle. Brass. It's a broken <laughs> watch, modern one. The old 50 pences, the larger to what you've got now. Elizabeth II, 50 pence. George V penny. Solid copper. And then Victoria. Victoria Penny. It's with the bunhead. George III, 1806, round about that period. Half penny. Come up reasonable clean now, you can see it, see the detail. And that's the tail side. Some sort of brass mount decoration, horse decoration. Some sort of horse decoration mount again. You can see the shield. Sixpence of uh, Georgia VI, just after the uh, war, so it'd be Cooper and Nickel. You don't put silver in this barrel in machine. So George VI, probably 1947 or something. Well, that's unusual. German coinage, one fennec or two fennec. I don't know which one it is actually. It might tell you there. Does it tell you? Yeah. Fennec, how many fennecs? Does it say actually? It's yeah. 26, Oh, it's two. Two fennecs. It's not much. Some, tot, some sort of brass ring. Could be Second World War, that. Brass ring. Unless it's gold inside. Doubt it. I'll check it out, but I can't see it being... Unless it's rose gold, I don't really know. But I'll check that out. But that's definitely a ring of the Second World War, if it's brass or copper, definitely. But if it's rose gold, we'll check that out. If there's any old marks. That's uh, Irish penny, got a cockerel on, and then the harp on the other side. It's a th three pence threepenny bit of Elizabeth II, 1960s, or that period. It's got a pot colours on the other side. Three pence. That's what they were like. And just show you that little tiny little coin. That I think they all lasted for about three years. But this is the half pence of Elizabeth II, 1970s. I think they were only just a couple of years before they brought them in and they just were worthless, so they just stopped making them. Half pence Elizabeth II. <laughs> Edward the Seventh, half penny. He only reigned for nine years. Rare to get hold of him. And his silver, his silver, his silver is a rarer as well. Oh wow! Look at that. It's a bit moth-eaten, but this is a William the Third, sixteen ninety-seven, half penny. But it's a bit bigger than that, is the half pennies. But it's quite a lot of it's gone. But that is a William the. Third, rare yet again for us to find. Uh, I don't think you can see much of the other side, but it's Britannica. So, really, 
some of this needs to, needs to go back into the cooking pot and, and clean a bit more but that's just roughly what they look like maybe a bit more cleaning well thanks for watching and catch you on an adventure on the field <laughs>